welcome KSL Gang. Oh, welcome KSL gang. So today we're going to be doing a continuation of my Bath and Body Works haul. I got more of the $4.95 mist. I got some new releases. I picked up some creams from the hand cream sale. And I also got some Victoria's Secret Pink Body Mist. Okay, let's jump in. Continuing from the $4.95 mist sale, I had to get the rest of these online. I got two of the warm vanilla sugars. I do have my comparison video up. It should be right after this one where I compare the one from last year and this one. I don't want to say too much about it in case you didn't see the other video, but I'm really glad I got two of them. And the new packaging is super pretty. Next up, we have Sensual Amber, and I hauled the body cream in the last video. I told y'all I had picked this up. I'm just now getting into this scent. I know it's been around for a while. It's a really nice amber and berry scent, so I can't wait to play around with this one. Next up, I have Chris Morning Air, which I did get last year. I believe this year is an online exclusive. This is a really nice one, and last year I always wanted to get a backup. So I was just hoping it came back out with it this year, and I'm glad they did. And the packaging is beautiful this year. It's a really nice, fresh, crisp apple and amber scent. And next up, we have Twilight Woods, which was another online exclusive. This one is such a classic. I definitely wanted it this year, especially seeing the packaging on it. I absolutely love the purple with the sparkling on it. Super cute. Next, I got three of the Midnight Amber Glow in a full size and a mini. I picked up the mini doing a $1.95 hand cream sale. I had a free reward, so I went ahead and got that. And I got the full size bottles on Mercari in a bundle. It was a super good deal. It was like two for 18 and the other one was in another bundle for a really good price. This one is regular $17.50, so two for 18 was an awesome deal. You can find some sellers on Mercari that are very reasonable in their pricing. When this one comes out and we have a fine frameless mist sale, I'll probably grab one more. Then I'll be good. But who knows? Because I absolutely love this one. And I do have my review up on it. Next up, we have Cozy Season. And I think these will be out maybe around the 15 or 18. I'm getting different dates. But sometimes next week, I believe. When I smell this one, it smells like something I have in my collection. I think I know what it is, but I'll say that for the review. I'm going to review these over the weekend and I'll come back at the beginning of the week and share my review on it. Next up, we got Pink Suede and I'm just going to say this one smells super girly and pretty. So I do want some backups of this one and I definitely have a review coming up. I'm loving the bottle styles on the new releases. I want to say Sweather Weather may come out in this packaging because the mini sweater weather looks just like this. We have Ivory Cashmere, and I did pick this one up last year and I loved it, but never got a backup. So I'm super happy it came out again this year. And if I smell a difference, I'll definitely come back and do a comparison video. For the $1.95 hand cream sale, I got Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte, Pumpkin Cupcake, Midnight Amber Glow, Coconut Milk, and Sunwash Citrus. They had all the ones I wanted except for White Coconut Caramel. That one and Midnight Amber Glow was my top picks, but I definitely should have picked up more Midnight Amber Glow. Moving on to Victoria's Secrets Pink, and I think some of these are repackages and some of them are new. So we have Cocoa Vanilla Mist, and I absolutely love the oil in this one. I'm like, why there's not a mist to go to this? So when I seen it, I grab them super quick. This one is coconut cream, vanilla bean, and spice pear. Even though it has that spice pear note, it still smells like the body oil. I was nervous at first. I was like, please let it smell like the body oil. And it does. It smells delicious. I already wore it. Loved it. Of course, I combine it with the oil. And I think they have a lotion or a cream. I don't know why I never got that one either. Super happy about this one. And I wouldn't mind getting a couple more when there's another sale. And next, I got two of the basic vanilla. And I think this actually came out last year, but I did not pick it up. This one has vanilla marshmallow and warm chai. When I smelled this one, I said, this makes a perfect layering scent. So I cannot wait to start using this one. Next up, we have Vanilla Clouds. And I do want to point out, they have came out with a lot of vanilla scents at one time. It always be like that one special vanilla scent. Maybe two, but not more than that that I recognize. This one has cotton wood and toasted hazelnut. I don't know why I did not get two of these. It's more than just a vanilla scent. It's like a warm, woody, and nutty vanilla. So this is definitely not a basic vanilla. It got a little something extra in there. Next up, we have Basic Pumpkin. Now, I'm not sure if this one was out 
out last year. I definitely wanted this one because they don't come out with too many pumpkin scents. I would say you can pair this one with Bath & Body Works Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte, but to me, they stand on their own. I don't think they necessarily need each other. They both have a really nice pumpkin latte scent to it and the marshmallow scent. Last, we have Basic Apple. I want to say this is probably one of the best smelling apple scents. It kind of gives me champagne, apple, and honey, but without the champagne note. It's like a pure honey crisp apple and it has the fall air note. So it smells like a juicy honey apple with that fall air note that gives it a little perfume scent. And I absolutely love it. I would have definitely picked up two of these, but I really thought it was going to smell like basic apple, but it's more than that. Okay, guys, that's going to complete my haul. Let me know, are you excited about the new releases from Bath & Body Works? And I did see that Pumpkin Become Waffles is coming back. Let me know if you picked up anything during the recent sales. But if you haven't now already, subscribe and join the KSL game. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Hey KSL game, if you love cooking and watching cooking videos and super easy recipes, make sure you check out my main channel in Kiki's Kitchen. I'll see you over there.